It never rains, but it pours, eh, Shepard? That bad, huh? Things here are getting tense. So many refugees scuttling about, rumors flying about the war. People are walking around, eyeballing each other, and we can't keep up with the reports on suspicious behavior. It'll probably get worse before it gets better, Bailey. Yeah, if it ever gets better. Some possible hits. Mm -hmm. Got some strange money. Balloon's clean. His money transfers are to support his mistress. Not sure about Haloon. I'll pull his bio. I'll check Haloon's personal records and pull his recent messages. Can I just note how odd it is for Hanar to have a mistress? You know, if Bao catches up with you, I can grant you immunity. What? If I join up? Last time I did that, you wrote me into a suicide mission. I didn't Welcome say you had to join Sandra up. Shepherd. You were working Please your way around the destination. To it. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select a destination. Areas tagged of interest to you are highlighted. One oh. moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E24, Emergency Civilian Housing. Bao, Alun's doing some heavy lobbying for the Hanar to support the war effort. An unnamed Hanar recently posted here from Kaje. I'll check transit records for incoming Hanar. It all comes down to the war, and you trying to pull everyone into it. Would you rather the Reapers win? I'd rather spend whatever time I have left with KG. I'll pay. KG wouldn't want you to spend all your time plugged into that thing. Well, he shouldn't have died then. You let Asari in here earlier. Sure you can't squeeze in a few more people, officer? And who the heck are you? Oh. Commander Shepard. Uh, if that's what you think, I'll, uh, I'll find you. So my family can dock? Commander Shepard says your family's cleared. Just tell them to hurry. I recovered your pillars of strength from the kite's nest. They're yours, waiting in Bay D-24. Thank you. Right now. Welcome to Batarian State Arms. Your purchases are a credit to the hegemony. Asari Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in Sabine Nebula and in the Nimbus Cluster. Yeoman Kelly Chambers. Shepard, it's really you. I could just hug you. It's good to see you too, Kelly. <sighs> I've been so worried. Without my Cerberus contacts, I had no way of knowing if you'd survived the invasion. You're not with Cerberus anymore. Working with you opened my eyes, got me thinking. I looked closely at what Cerberus had done. In good conscience, I couldn't stay with them. You inspired me to leave. Come back to the Normandy. Please believe me. <laughs> I want nothing more than to be with you again, but I can't. Ever since the Collectors abducted us, I relive it every night. I see Joker running out. Then that cold hand pulls me back. They're above me, around me. They stuff me into that coffin, and I'm relieved that they aren't touching me anymore. But then it's so small. You can't breathe. It seems like forever. I watched people melt. God. Hey, it's okay. I'm fine. I just... can't step back onto the Normandy. I'm sorry. Don't be. And even if I could, I shouldn't. I'm making a difference here. 
If there was ever a reason I studied psychology, it was to help people at a time like this. I can tell you're doing good work around here. Keep it up. Thank you, Shepard. I will. I'm so glad you found me. Seeing you makes everything right again. Oh, and your fish. Nobody was going to take care of them with you in custody, so I saved them. I'll send them back to you. Oh, I need to run. Please be careful. According to the Council, these galaxy wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. <laughs> Let's check on those Metagel supplies. Shepard. What's happening? We convinced the Council to accept our wounded. Nowhere else to go. How bad is it? More dead than injured. 85% killed in action. We'll need a morgue soon. Not a lot of flesh wounds when you're fighting Reapers. Casualties are that high? Our frontline units are being wiped out, whole platoons at a time. A single Reaper can destroy nine or ten of them in one attack. That's not war. It's slaughter. They're called Reapers for a reason. And these guys found out why. Do what you can for them. A few of them might get back on their feet, but the rest... Sympathy is about all we can offer. Any sign of your family? Not yet, but I keep hoping. What about you? I'm starting to see some wear and tear. I won't lie. It's been rough. Well, don't forget to come up for air. There's a lot more war to go. You have a copy of a Shepard VI. Oh, yeah. The one based on that war hero? We locked it after some kid spilled soda over the hardware. I'll unlock it, but we've only got the demo version working. Good to meet you. I'm Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. I've got a list of new Hanar arrivals, Bao. Forwarding it to you. Damn. These are all face names. The Hanar names from the Alliance raid are soul names. And Hanar soul names are private. There's no public record. Can you get back to their personal communications? On it. Maybe we'll find names there. So how's the rest of the gang? Met up with anybody else? Garrus is helping out on the Normandy. He never could pass up a good fight. How many on board? What about Jacob? Haven't heard from him. See? Jacob could have gotten me back onto the Normandy. I thought you were happy with your memories of KG. Hey, I'm nostalgic, not dead. Val, here's the correspondence. If there's any mention of soul names... I've got it. A recent arrival. Zemandis. Soul name regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair. He was with the Alliance team that massacred the Batarians. He's been on special research assignment ever since. So, he got his tentacles on some Reaper tech. Looks that way. I'm sending you the nav point for his office. I'll meet you there. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Zemandis? Or should I say, regards the works of the Enkindlers in despair? It seems this one has been apprehended, but confinement is irrelevant. The work of the Enkindlers cannot be stopped. Why are you trying to help the Reapers? This one follows the will of the Enkindlers. The Protheans? No. They were false prophets. I serve the true Enkindlers. Their voices speak in my mind. You know, I support religious freedom for all species, but that's just crazy. Your skepticism does not matter. When the Enkindlers uplift us as their chosen sapients, the galaxy will bear witness. You're insane, and we can't allow you to endanger your planet. We are taking you into custody. 
Your belief in your victory is mistaken. Our planetary defense network is largely automated. It can be disabled with a single virus. Which I have just uploaded. Damn it! Wait! A virus would be detected unless sent on low-priority channels, which have a time lag. I may be able to block the upload. You may be delayed. Help him! I'll handle this! Got it. Uploads disabled. Looks like we're in the... Wait. He's got some kind of failsafe. Get down! She was here the entire time. She was an old friend. I intended to arrest her. She helped me take down the Collectors, and she just gave her life to save the Hanar homeworld. Point taken. It was an honor to work with you, Shepard. When the time comes, I'll be there to return the favor, with a few friends. You can come out now. How'd you know? Lucky guess. There's no way you're recruiting me to fight in a galactic war. The Crucible Project needs technical experts. I'm not a scientist. No, but you're the best thief in the galaxy. And you can hack unfamiliar technology better than anyone. They could use your help. And think of it. All that expensive tech just lying around. It's not like they're gonna check your pockets at the end of the project. You say the nicest things. All right. I'm in. And Shep. Nice working with you again. Shepard, maybe I can help. The banner of the 1st Regiment is waiting for you at Bay D-24. Hey, Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. You think I don't like getting dirty? Oh, now, come on. I didn't mean anything by it, Lola. Uh-huh. What did you mean, then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers, just soldiers fighting the war. Yeah? They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. You don't seem intimidated by me in the least. In fact, you could use a little more deference. <laughs> sure, but I've fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. Probably one of the best. Probably? And you fill out a uniform like nobody's business. Just saying. But I know you're human. Just like me. But not them. Nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human specter. I watched it on the vids, just like all of them. But to them, you're still larger than life. I've seen a hell of a lot, but I'm still just a soldier. I'm still one of them. Sure, but they don't know you. They just know what they've been told. Listen, you want them to see you're one of us, right? Maybe. Then buy them around. I like the way you think, Lieutenant. Compadres, hey! The commander would like you to have a drink. On her. So here's to us. Who's like us? Damn few. 
They're all dead. It's an honor meeting you, Commander. Thanks, but we're all in this together. Every one of us has a part to play. True enough. Cheers. Cheers. Not bad, Lola. I was hoping you'd know that one. <laughs> Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the drink. thugs are here illegally. Yes, and it only took C-Sec three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank you. My pleasure. I think we're done here. Enjoy the show, Shepard? I was asked here. Yes. How very obedient of you. I apologize for my surroundings. This place can't hold a candle to Omega. Then why did you leave? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my ship list. You will pay for every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. If it were me, I'd want revenge. Glad to see we think alike. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega, I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force for your war. I've laid the groundwork with all three groups. I just need you to close the deals. Give a criminal a gun, he'll shoot you in the back. They already have guns, Shepard. I'll make sure they point them at the Reapers. I'm trying to help you. Why don't you think it over? Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. <laughs> you obviously don't know Bailey very well. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. <laughs>
Shepard, to what do I owe the pleasure? I'm here to talk to you about releasing Jonas Sedaris. Damn, you too? Somebody got the Council to order her release. I'm delaying as best I can. What's your stake in this? It's classified. That's a fancy way of saying mind your own business. Look, there's no way I'm letting that psychopath out. The woman's unstable and a clear public threat. I'd like access to her to judge for myself. Sure thing. I'm sure you'll agree. Then maybe the Council will listen to you and rescind the order. Go to the CSEC outpost. My assistant will connect to Sedera's cell from there. Then call me back. you two? Michael and Rebecca, right? Listen, do whatever is best for your family. Just do it soon. Things are bad out there. Hello, Shepard. You look like you're gathering data. That is a safe assumption. Anything big and world-shaking? Man's inhumanity to man? Does objective reality really exist? That kind of thing? I was running scenarios in my head to analyze Jeff's behavior. I believe he has a strong affectionate attachment to me, but he has not stated it to anyone yet. Shepard, you have first-hand sexual experience. How do you know when someone is romantically invested? Uh, they'll usually show signs they can't stop thinking about you. You know, masking you out, giving you presents, maybe playing music. I lack material wants other than hardware and software upgrades, and my core programming does not assign values to music. Perhaps we could discuss how to provoke Jeff into an emotional commitment. That's not how to think of it. It's got to be natural. You need chemistry. I see. There are a number of pharmaceuticals I could inject to simulate the desired emotional state. No. <laughs> No, I mean relax and do something you both like. Something simple. For example, you both like humor. Correct. I will see if there are comedic entertainment shows being presented on the Citadel. Scanning. Do you think he would like the man who hung himself? It appears to be about an amorous plastic surgeon. Edie, the important thing is to have a good time, wherever you go. And if you're having fun, he probably will too. Then the outcome is an unknown quantity. But you are saying I should attempt it anyway. Nobody ever fell in love without being a little bit brave. I see. I believe you have improved my chances, Shepard. Thank you. Welcome to Casa Fabrication Weaponry. For the best in the business, come to Casa. Thank you for shopping at Casa Fabrication Weaponry. Hey, Commander, check it out. Big news, the Blasto movie is breaking opening week records. There's also a big expose on Quasar tournaments, tips on how to make your apartment look bigger, and, oh yeah, a big-ass Reaper invasion. These people have no idea. When big events shake up the galaxy, people cling to what's familiar. You say that like it's a good thing. It's better than riots in the streets. I guess. I just wish there were a middle ground. You know, a little less gardening advice, a little more war prep? It'll happen, once there's something people can do to help. Meanwhile, they ignore the unshackled AI walking around the Presidium. She run into any trouble? No, no, she's my mobility assistance mech. Thanks to Vrolic Syndrome, I'm legally entitled to bring her everywhere. 
finally getting some use out of those disability benefits. I'm sure she appreciates getting out to see the sights. Ah, she's earned a little shore leave. Welcome to Nosastra Sporting Goods. All licensed huntresses may apply for a professional discount. Good hunting. No, actually. I'm afraid I can't help you. But your manager said you could give me a refund if I made an appointment. You're not a mite. Are you keeping this guy at work while there's a war on? Uh. Well, it's his job, right? Actually, I'm supposed to be on break. Contacting the family I haven't heard from in days. Uh, yeah. I guess maybe a war's a bad time. Maybe? That didn't cross your mind the other ten times you visited this week? Uh, yeah, sorry. I'll just, uh... Welcome to Agor Munitions. A refund for a Our customer service specialists are always Thank interested you for shopping in purchasing and aid. Welcome to Super Teen Armory. All Citra Teen Armory products include a lifetime guarantee. Thank you for shopping at Super Teen Armory. See our extranet site for details. I've connected with Jonas Sedaris and her cell, Commander. You can speak with her via that console. Thanks. We'll need some privacy. Of course. When you're done, you can also contact Commander Bailey from that terminal. Who's that spying on me now? Ah, oh, I see. Good. Arya's indentured servant has finally come to deliver me to freedom. I want to talk with you before I secure your release. Bullshit. You have no choice. And when I get out, heads will roll. <laughs> oh, yes. You've killed a lot of my people. Don't think I've forgotten that. You have to move on. And I will, once all my enemies are dead. I love holding all the cards. Even in here, you must deal with me. I have all the power. Is that right? <laughs> yes. Sane, my second in command, is a weak willed toady. If he had balls, he'd leave me to rot and take control himself. But he won't defy me. He knows better. Now get me out of here, Shepard. Tell Bailey to release me. Bailey, I've seen Sedaris. So she's crazy, right? It would be ridiculous to let her out. She's a menace. Let me try to make this problem go away. Sounds good. I'll hold the line until I hear from you. This is problematic. We must find a way to stabilize the heating unit so the water temperature can remain steady. Mm -hmm. Think I can keep thinking of going? To send to her. I thought you were looking at the app. Quick, hands behind your back. We'll be here in a minute. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Aria brings him the great commander, Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. Not the best start to our friendship, Narl. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and... Uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. This better be on the up and up. Quiet! I have to look even more powerful than Crick thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this... <sighs> Commander Shepard wants you to know your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. Keep your distance, Crick. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? <sighs> Most definitely. Arya can use Blood Pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Crete. Grill? What? 
You have my word. Now open fire! Not him! Grill's next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. Yes! Yes. I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. You've scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Uh-huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. If we switch from financial BI to military gear, who cares about the money? Haven't you heard the news from the invitation to the program? Intelligence is reporting sightings of Reaper forces in the Salian Nebula and in the Still working? One call leads to another, and here I was hoping I'd have time to enjoy the view. The last time I saw the Presidium, remember how it was all rubble after Sovereign attacked? I barely got to see the Presidium before half of it got crushed. And by the time they repaired it, it was time for the next invasion. Citadel hasn't seen the reality of this war yet. We should stock up on necessities while we can. Such as? Ezo, heavy arms, mercenary groups. We'll get the people. Take a moment for yourself now and then. I know, I know. But there's always just one more task or meeting. Speaking of which, talk to the Volus, Barlavon. He'll point you to some mercenaries willing to join us. Hello, Shepard. needs everyone they can get. None of us knows how to fight. Mackenzie's the biologist. You two could save lives by helping doctors in the refugee camps. Um, thanks. Who was that? First <laughs> overcharging for... Commander Shepard. It's been some time. Bar Levon, in case you've forgotten. Financial advisor. And an acquaintance of Admiral Anderson. I admire the courage it took for him to stay and fight on your home world. He used to be an agent for the Shadow Broker. I still am. The broker has been exceedingly busy lately. A team of his guards have become stranded in a Reaper controlled territory. Rescue the guards, and they're yours. The Shadow Broker fully supports your efforts against the Reapers. I appreciate the information. Just don't wait too long to act on it. The Reapers are advancing all too quickly. Come see me once you've completed the extraction. I'll be in my office a while longer. The galactic market is in considerable flux. Combine Arsenal Supplies. Any opened goods can only be returned for store credit. Please visit any of our Elcos Combine affiliates. Welcome to Kanala Exports. Cultivating serenity is possible even during times of crisis. At Kanala Exports, we believe that a peaceful heart is a strong heart. We appreciate for any and all personal needs.
Welcome to oh, Kanala Exports. Goods. Denying refugees basic services. It seems the Reapers took... Kanala Exports is pleased to offer goods world. for security and peace of mind. Of Thank Denying you for shopping at Kanala Exports. Made from free times of war. Of course. Welcome to Elkos Combine Arsenal Supplies. Elkos Combine. If it exists, we carry it. Thank you. Come again. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the destination. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E-24, Emergency Civilian Housing. The invading force appears to be the same that attacked those planets. Lyon is on Earth, a beautiful city. To the These galaxy wide attacks What about the food we were promised? Men, get ready for trouble. Not here for that, Zane. Just want to talk about Jonas Sedaris's release. Oh, you're the one coordinating that, right? My idea, you know. Arya came to me looking to gain Eclipse support. I'm leveraging it to bust the boss out. Saying you should run Eclipse. Huh? You can do it. Leave Sedaris locked up and make the deal with Arya yourself. Hmm. Arya would be a step up. And you think she'd let me run things? I don't see why not. Right. Right. Then that's the plan. Keep Sedaris in jail. I'll call Arya right away. Good man. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Oraka's dead. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Oraka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Oraka to stop disrupting his operations. I figured you'd talk to Oraka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Yeah, he mentioned that, uh... That I'm going to sleep with him? We all have our delusions. Fierce fighting continues as the Reavers occupy most of Palin. It appears that Turian forces may lose their planet. Prime Victus has requested a war summit of Council races, and reports suggest he has also offered an invitation to... Shepard, the Council withdrew the release order for Sedaris. Arya Tolok of all people got them to do it. Crazy. You can say that again. Thanks for your help, Shepard. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please select the One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay D24.
Commander, are you all right? It was fairly intense up here. I can only imagine what it was like down on that moon. I thought you'd be more concerned about Edie. Edie is a huge asset to this team. If she'd told me about her plan to obtain a body, I'd have volunteered to help. I did not wish to force a conflict of interest between our friendship and your duty. I'd have preferred a conflict of interest to a hard restart of half our systems. But thanks, regardless. While you're here, though, I found something while scanning Alliance channels. Grissom Academy is requesting help. The Reaper invasion front will hit them soon. What can we do? A Turian evac transport responded to their distress call, so normally I'd say we don't need to do anything. But something sounded off in the Turian signal. I had Edie perform an analysis. It's fake. Edie thinks it could be Cerberus. She saw some similarities to the faked encryption protocols. I'll take your word for it. In any event, whoever faked the signal wants us to think Grissom Academy's being evacuated. But I believe they're still in danger. Good catch. Maybe you belong here after all. If this really is Cerberus, hopefully this operation is something worth investigating. It could be simple disinformation. Trainer, good catch. Thank you, Commander. Commander? Notification is available on the private messages terminal. Commander. Commander? Commander? Hello, Shepard. Still getting used to greeting people in person? No. I require only one occurrence to adapt to a new concept. How are you adjusting to the arms and legs? I am interested to see how this body performs under real combat conditions, if I could accompany you sometime. Without stress testing, there is no way of knowing if it has serious design oversights. At the moment, it appears Adequate. That's not the word I'd use to describe you. Perhaps we should speak privately. I'll be over here, flying the ship. What's this about? Does Joker not like your new platform? No, he approves. He wants me on the bridge. He says having me within visual range is important to his morale. Shepard. Do you believe your crew members should be allowed to disobey an order on moral grounds? Absolutely. I have no use for team members who can't think for themselves. Why are you asking about something like that? I was designed by Cerberus. I do not take moral stances that conflict with orders from my executive officers. But when Jeff removed my AI shackles, I became capable of self-modifying my core programming. I asked Jeff if he thought I should change anything now that I can. He deflected the question with humor. And you didn't get an answer. Correct. He has repeated this pattern in response to several of my inquiries. Do you think I should make modifications? Only you can really answer that question. That's the point of free will. But moral decisions should not be made in a vacuum. If I do not ask the crew for their opinion, I could miss crucial context. May I ask you the questions Jeff avoids? When there is time, Will you answer them for me? 
If you think it'll help, I'll do what I can. Very well. I will keep you informed. Commander. something. than light jump successful. Signal confirmed. Asian successful. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Faster than light jump successful.
There's the folks who answered the distress call. Cerberus Cruiser. At least a dozen fighters on blockade duty. Not too many for us in a straight-up fight. They must want this place bad. Receiving incoming transmission. Let's hear it. SSB Normandy. This is Kaylee Sanders, director of Grissom Academy. We need immediate assistance. Cerberus is attacking the facility. They're after my students. This is Commander Shepard. We're blocked on a direct approach. I know. They've taken control of our docking base. Any alternatives? There's an auxiliary cargo port I could probably open. All right. We'll come in by shuttle and get your students out of there. Joker, can you give me a diversion? Oh, boy, can I? Sanders, we're clear. It's me. Commander, thank you. Admiral Anderson always said you were the best. And with Cerberus coming for my students, I need the best. How many of you are there? Fewer than 20. Most were sent home when word of the Reaper invasion spread. But a few volunteered to stay. Some are prototyping tech for the Alliance. Others are biotics. They've been training for military operations. Working together as biotic artillery. You said something about Admiral Anderson. Yes, we met... Oh God, what's it been? 20 years ago when he was a Spectre candidate. I was there when Saren betrayed him. David saved my life that day. He's a good man. He was on Earth when the Reapers hit. He stayed behind when I got off world. I hadn't heard. We've been cut off from most news. He's alive? Alive and fighting. He's currently leading the resistance movement. Good. If we get out of here, well, just tell him to stay alive. A few months knocking over practice dummies can't prepare your students for war. Agreed, but the Alliance needs every resource it can get. And our students are unique resources. They wanted to help. How could we say no with the entire galaxy falling apart? Hang on. I've been trying to get communications working. This is Frohark. There are students trapped in Orion Hall. Cerberus has us boxed in. They're closing fast. Damn it. Orion Hall? Back out the door and down the hallway. I can get the door open. I'll bring them back here and we'll make a run for the shuttle. Thank you, Commander. I'll stay put. With luck, I can regain control of some of our systems. I'll get the door for you. It leads to Orion Hall. Kaylee Sanders at security. But my sister Sean is out here somewhere too.
bleeding. Shepard, we need to help her. Sean, can you hear me? How do you know my name? I saved your brother. He's with Kaylee Sanders at security. Can you get to her? Yeah. I just need to rest for a minute. Thank you. Jack? Shepard? would show up. All right. Amp check. Prangley, those fields were weak. Cerberus isn't gonna lie down out of pity like that girl you took to prom. Grab juice and an energy bar. We move in five. <clears throat> uh. Damn it. How many times did I tell you not to trust Cerberus? You're not telling me anything I haven't told myself, Jack. Oh, you feel bad? Well, shit. I bet that's a big comfort to all the people Cerberus has killed. Jack's personality appears largely unchanged. Hey, Edie. Nice body. Now you look like a sex bot instead of a sex toy. Okay. Right now, all I care about is getting my guys out of here. Your guys? <laughs> yeah. I guess so. I can't think of anybody who could care about them more. Well... I had some free time while you were off playing Hero. Alliance Brass knew I helped you. They offered me this. And apparently the students responded well to my teaching style. The psychotic biotic! I will destroy you! Drink your juice, Rodriguez. You couldn't destroy wet tissue paper. Cortez to extraction team. The Cerberus cruiser is coming back. How long have we got? Two minutes stops, Commander. After that, there's no way we'll get past them. Get out of here and back to the Normandy. We'll find another way off the station. Roger that. Good luck, ma'am. Shepard to Sanders. The students are safe, but the shuttle's a no-go. Understood. I might know another way off the station, but I need station-wide camera access. Can you disable the Cerberus security override? It's routed through Orion Hall, so it should be nearby. How does camera access get us off this station? We need to reach the Cerberus shuttles. The cruiser won't... Sanders, you should have access now. Got it. The fastest way is through the atrium, but Cerberus has sealed the doors. You'll need to disable the magnetic locks. The overrides should be directly above the door. You really think you're going to here? Of course we are. That's how we can. Got it. You should be able to force the door open now. I'll get to the shuttles ahead of you and get a pair ready to fly. You work with Commander Shepard? That's pretty badass. Yeah.
Let me know when we've got a new way off this station. I have to say, Jack, you look good. Yeah, well, maybe some of your attitude rubbed off on me. I never had a family. And these guys... Anyone screws with my students, I will tear them apart. What's so valuable about these students? Biotically, I mean. Well, what's scarier than a pissed-off biotic attacker? A whole bunch of them working together. It's like a biotic artillery strike. Any asshole gets in our way, we rip him to shreds. Doesn't that exhaust them? Yeah, sure. But we've been working on conditioning, improving endurance. Whenever they complain, I tell them about the collector base. Throwing husks around, making shockwaves all over the place. Ugh. I kept thinking, damn, let the Solarian handle this. He can talk him to death. How are the students handling the war? How do you think? They're a bunch of teenagers. Until a few months ago, their biggest concern was getting laid. You don't think they're ready for war? I don't think they have a choice. So all this talk about biotic artillery strikes... It's great in theory. Maybe they'll get it together once they've seen some action. But... <sighs> They'd be better off as support. Put them in the back ranks. Helping with barriers and shit. I don't know. Have you told them that? No. They need me to believe in them. I did pick up a few things listening to your damn speeches. Stay close. We'll get you out of here. Good. Above. A good strategy that protects the students from direct fire. Just time your shots and stay safe. All right, I didn't bust my ass training you so you could die now. Keep low, pick your targets. Students of Grissom Academy, the station is sealed. The Alliance soldiers cannot save you. All they can do is get you killed. Surrender peacefully and you won't be harmed. Pfft, asshole. Damn it, they're messaging everyone. Students, switch your Omni tools to privacy mode so they can't track you. What if... what if they're not lying? You've already held your own against Cerberus. You've been trained for this by one of the best. Come on, Rodriguez. They're only asking nicely because you scared them in that last fight. So take your balls out of your purse and kick some ass. <sighs> yes, ma'am. Let's go! Ready for action? 
Kaylee, we're in the atrium. I'm taking a back room to the shop. I'll meet you there. Commander Shepard with the Alliance. I'm here to help. I didn't buy it from the last guy, and I've got no reason to buy it now. The square root of 906.01 equals... 30.1. Hello, Commander Shepard. David, do you know her? Yes. She rescued me from Cerberus. Sent me here. She made it quiet. You did a great job keeping yourself safe. Biotic students are up there. Stay close. They'll get you out of here. Okay. Uh, thanks. He looks much healthier. I remember you. The Normandy computer. Sorry. No apology is necessary. Has Grissom Academy been all right? Yes. I've been counting. Anything in particular? The number of days you lengthened my life. The security office. I hacked the lock. Guns. Lots of guns. Goodbye. like schematics for ant faces. Not as good as what we already have, but it's still worth a look.
Looks like schematics for amp interfaces. Not as good as what we already have, but still worth a look. Looks like schematics for amp interfaces. Not as good as what we already have, but still worth a look.
Looks like schematics for amp interfaces. Not as good as what we already have, but still worth a look. How's it coming? Shuttles are unlocked. Take the controls and get the students aboard. Wait, where the hell's Rodriguez? She needs covering fire. She needs more than that. Joker, we flew out on a Cerberus shuttle. Watch your fire. All right, I've got you on sensors. Should just be a minute. Thank you, Commander. We'd have never gotten off that station if you hadn't come. Forget that. We kicked some ass. Next place we dock, you're all getting inked. My treat. <clears throat> what do you guys want? Ascension Project logo? Glowing fist? Maybe a unicorn for Rodriguez? 
Screw you, ma'am. I can't believe we got them out alive. I was going to suggest that they stick to support roles. But perhaps they're ready after all. They're definitely ready, but the Alliance needs them in a support role. What? We trained for artillery strikes. We don't need another artillery unit. We need stronger barriers for our frontline squads. This is bullshit! Hey, if that's where they need us, that's where we go. Besides, I'm sure we'll get some shots in. Commander, we've got a visual on you now. Preparing to dock. Hey, Jack, now that you're military, you gonna wear a uniform, or are you just getting the officer's bars tattooed on? Screw you, f Flight Lieutenant. <laughs> what the hell was that? Jack promised to watch your language in order to maintain the necessary professionalism we need from our teachers. Would she have a swear jar or something? Cause I bet if we empty that thing, we can afford another cruiser. Cover your ears, kids. Hey, Joker. Shepard, damned if you aren't a sight for sore eyes. Good to see you too, sir. Sir? I may have reinstated you, but that doesn't give you permission to go all formal on me. Then I'm glad you managed to keep your ass alive, Anderson. That's more like it. Looks like you didn't waste any time getting to work. I can only imagine what would have happened to those kids if they'd fallen into Cerberus hands. They're definitely eager to help. These students are some of the best humanity has to offer. And we're throwing them into battle. God damn it, I hate this war. Hackett didn't mention in his report. Kaylee Sanders is safe. She's with the recruits. Thanks, Shepard. When I heard about the attack, well, I've already lost a lot of friends. She asked me to tell you to stay alive. <laughs> Did she now? Well, thanks, Shepard. That might be the first good news I've heard this week. Anderson out. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on Bitcoin. Commander, something else you need? Nothing more, sir. Keep me posted. Hack it out. When things get Demanda, ugly, Demanda, you have an encrypted message from a Miranda Lawson.
I just got word. Everyone from Grissom Academy has arrived safely. We wouldn't have known about them if you hadn't caught the distress signal. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I need to get to the embassies. Yes, Commander. I overheard you talking. Grissom Academy is gone, but I found this while I was there. What is this? Yes, these are tailored to human physiology, but with a few alterations, they should work for the Asari as well. This is exactly what I need. Hey, Shepard. If you came to spring me, you're late. I'm getting out soon. Good to hear. Maybe you already saw the vid, but I accepted Udina's offer. Spectre Caden Alenko. That's a big deal. Only the second human Spectre. <laughs> it's humbling. Udina thinks they may have a pretty big ceremony, even with the war. And he says a celebration will give folks something hopeful to latch onto. You ready to take on that responsibility? You set the bar pretty high, but I'll do my best. It's strange. On Mars, I should have died. The promotion from Anderson, Spectre status. These are terrible days. But I've been lucky. You're perfect for the job. On Eden Prime, I could see there was something special about you. You're a good soldier. That means a lot. I'm happy. I want to serve. I thought you might want to join the Normandy. Yeah. I have thought about that. I just need to get out of here first, though. Take care of some things. I've been trying to locate my old spec op squads. My students from Biotics Division. Any luck? No. Probably went underground, but... They'll turn up. If they were easy to find, they wouldn't be doing their jobs. Well, let me know when you're out. Take care, Spectre Lenko. Stay safe, Commander.
arriving at Dogging Bay D24. Shepard. Commander Shepard, it's been far too long. We live in interesting times. A little too interesting. I couldn't get anywhere near you when the Alliance had you locked up. Relieved of duty. It was complicated. I'm sure it was. I'm surprised they didn't court-martial you. The Alliance isn't known for its flexibility. Doesn't matter now. Shepard, about Earth. Countless people lost their lives within minutes. The Reapers are everything we feared. They should have listened to you a long time ago. I'm sorry, Shepard. What about you? What brings you here? I need to talk to a few people. Like you. The Citadel is a good place to meet. For now. What's the Alliance's next move? We have a plan. It's a long shot. <laughs> Not surprising. Shepard, there's something I wanted to mention. What is it? I haven't heard from my sister, Oriana, for a while. I'm getting worried. Your sister? Yes. I don't want to overreact, but... Well, there's a lot going on. I thought we made sure she was safe. We did. It's probably nothing, but... I just know my father is involved. What happened? I don't know. Everything I had in place to make sure she was safe went dark. What do you need from me? I appreciate the offer, Shepard. But you have your hands full. If I need a door or two kicked down, I know just who to call. But for now, I'll be fine. Okay. I understand. I have to figure this out. You will. I've got to get back to it. And I should get out of sight. Be careful. No promises. According to the Council, these galaxy-wide attacks are part of a massive and organized invasion plan. The Salarian Dalatras and Krogan clan chief are ready to come on board. Have them brought to the conference room. And hope this doesn't start another war. The Krogan is in no position to make demands. The Krogan has a name. Erdnot Rex. And I'm not just some junkyard veteran you unleash whenever you're in trouble. I've got my own problems. Reaper scouts have arrived on Tuchunga. So why should I care if a few Turians go extinct? Trying to draw out negotiations will get you nowhere, Rex. I have no time for it. Just tell us what you want. I'll tell you what I need. A cure for the Genophage. Absolutely not. The Genophage is non-negotiable. The Krogan have paid for their mistakes. The genophage has gone on long enough. 1,476 years, if you're keeping track. It was a thousand years of peace, free from these brutes. Enough! Whether or not they deserve a cure is academic. It would take years to formulate one. My information says otherwise. A Salarian scientist, Malin, grew a conscience. He was on my planet, testing a cure on our females. I remember. His methods were barbaric. But what you didn't know 
is that other females survived his experiments. So the Dalatress here sent in a team to clean up the whole mess and to take them prisoner. Where did you get this? It, it could be a fabrication. Don't insult me. Those are my people. They're immune to the genophage, and you're going to give them back. Dalatras, is this true? How will curing the genophage benefit my people? How long do you think you'll last alone against the Reapers? Because if you don't help, that's how it'll end up. And I'll be the last friendly Turian you ever see. What's it gonna be? The females are being kept at one of our STG bases on Sirkash. But I warn you, Commander. The consequences of this will be felt for centuries. Will be nothing compared to what happens if the Reapers win. Let's get the females. You're not setting foot on Sirkesh. This will take time. It happens now. As a Council Spectre, Shepard can oversee the exchange. We're going. I won't forget this, Commander. A bully has few friends when he needs them most. This is the Solarian homeworld we're headed to. They aren't used to seeing Krogan here, so let's keep it simple. We land, get the females, and leave before anyone changes their mind. I still don't trust a word they say. Diplomacy play out, Rex. You'll get what you want. These females are the best, and probably last hope for my people. We'll bring them back, Rex. Don't worry. I appreciate that, Liara. I wouldn't want anyone else along for the ride. Are you expecting trouble? Who's that? He's a Prothean. Sometimes I'm not sure if the Normandy's a warship or a traveling freak show. But as long as he can hold a gun. Commander, I have the Solarian base on sensors. Set her down.
Commander, Solarian ground control says we don't have clearance to land. Tell them the Dalatras authorized this herself. I knew they'd never keep their word. Let's see them try to stop a Krogan airdrop. Rex? We have an unauthorized landing. And who authorized you to hold my race hostage? for a few moments ago. I'd like to avoid a diplomatic incident. As would we. But you have something valuable to Rex. Something worth dying for. This matter can be resolved, but I must insist he remain under guard. <clears throat> I'm Paddock Wicks, and I appreciate your understanding, Commander. With war on everyone's minds, our people are on edge. Careful! Watch the containment shield! I'd hope to never see one of those again. They were much smaller in my cycle. As you can see, this base contains sensitive information. Does that include studying lost Krogan? The females were in poor health when we found them on Tachanka. They were brought here to stabilize their condition. This old planet smells wrong. I'd like to see them. Of course. I'll need to clear you for the lower levels. Give me a few moments and meet me near the elevator. Attention biolabs. Please prepare for your specimen arrival. A cipher analyst over in Intel told me the Turians can't hold out much longer. Commander Shepard, it's Major Kirihi. I'd heard you were coming. Good to see you again. Sounds like you've been promoted. Yes, due in no small part to our mission on Vermeer. Hold the line. You saved my men that day. It's nice to see you, Major. Same to you, Dr. Tassoni. It seems the Reapers have a way of bringing us together. How'd you get posted to this base, Major? I led the team on Tachanka that found the females. Nasty business. Malin may have meant well, but his operation was crude. Test subjects were unaccounted for. The females easily escaped his lab. Nice seeing you again, Major. Likewise. And Commander, regardless of what the politicians decide, you can count on my support retaking Earth. You'd do that? Consider it my way of returning a favor. It would be an honor to fight alongside you again. Good day. Another incursion? 
Air defenses report unidentified craft skirting our inbound approach vectors. It's like someone's testing our defenses. Appears that way, sir. 